Looks like one of the long distance Pathfinder probes has malfunctioned. It wouldn't normally be a big deal, but we've already lost two, so they're becoming precious. Finding a habitable planet depends on having as many working probes as possible, and that means yours truly will have to head out and fix it. I'm not expecting it to be a challenge from a technical point of view, but the probe is light years away. It will take the maintenance shuttle six months to reach it, and another six to get back. So, I'll be on my own for a year. Maybe someone will let me have their coffee ration. I just returned to the Spear of Hope, having repaired the Pathfinder drone. There's just one problem. Uh, I've returned to a ghost ship. I mean, the whole place has been evacuated. I've checked the data logs, and it looks like the crew found a viable planet about eight months ago. The Spear of Hope was going to take them right past it, so they staged an emergency evacuation. According to the log, 5,000 people left the ship in about an hour. I guess no one had time to think about one lonely technician out in the black. So now I've got to work out how to get to them. I always did enjoy a challenge. Every last ship and shuttle is gone. There's no emergency fuel either, so my shuttle is all but useless. I can't even tap into the Spear of Hope's fuel line because it's powered by a propulsion drive. <sighs> that said, all is not lost. I took a look at the engine schematics, and I think I can adjust the ship's trajectory using a nearby star. The idea is to get close enough to the star's gravity well to slingshot around it. Hopefully, I'll be able to put the ship on an approach vector for the planet. Honestly, I think the chances of it working are slim, but it's the only chance I've got. I've gone over the numbers and I think I can make it work. The only snag is it'll take a while to reach the next viable star. And when I say a while, I mean a really, really long while. If the numbers are correct, I should reach the planet in about 93 years. I run the calculations countless times, but the results are always the same. The next time I see another human being, I'll be 132 years old. Let's just hope they've built a retirement home on this planet. Зарядка FST 